When applying hard coat stucco finish systems along with thin stone veneer claddings, we use Easy Bead as an expansion material between all dissimilar materials, most notably in penetrations, windows, and doors, and also up along the trim. Caulking the expansion area where the Easy Bead is eliminates the intrusion of moisture. Prior to the application of hard coat stucco finish systems and thin stone veneer, the windows are protected with film and tape, protecting the easy bead and keeping it clean. Once our contractor takes off the film, he begins to clean the surface prior to application of the uh, sealant. So here we go. The expansion flange with the easy bead acts as a backer, basically replacing backer rod. So it's already installed. Now our contractor's cleaned everything off, and he just starts caulking right away. And he's got a backup material to accept the sealant. And there's a bond breaking tape on it, so we do not get three-sided adhesion. You can see how quickly he can go. The stucco or stone contractor can do the work as soon as he takes the uh, film off the windows and the protection. Economically, it saves a lot of money on the job for him to do it. Of course, there's uh, better ways to tool the joint. There are tools to be used uh, to tool the sealant. We know that. But the reality is in the field, this is often how it's done. And uh, so that's how we're showing you. It's actually pretty effective. So what you're seeing here is uh, today is our tan easy bead being used with earth tone windows and an earth tone sealant. We also want to apply along the trim area so at all where all dissimilar materials come in contact. So here's dissimilar material coming into contact with stucco. So we have to separate them with expansion material and then use a sealant to keep it moisture proof. And now we've got everything done. Our system's in place on this small project. And for those of you who have never seen Easy Bead installed, let's work backwards after we've seen the sealant applied. Easy Bead is a casing bead with an expansion flange attached to it. That expansion flange is there for spacing the casing bead away from the window for expansion or the penetration. It has a bomb breaking tape attached to it, so we do not get three sided adhe adhesion of the sealant, which can fail, and we only have two sided adhesion, which is what we want. Integrated properly with our drip cap at our windows and our doors so that water sheds over and around. So let's see the installation. So first we come down the jam of the window and we're going to make a cut on the rigid part of the flange. And then we're also going to make a cut on the expansion part of the flange, the flexible part, just a V cut. We're going to come under the sill and over to the other side, and we're going to make our cuts again. And then up the opposite jam, and we're going to come down that jam and marry them in together. Our lath is then applied, and we cut our lath and bring it into the ground of the easy bead. And now we do our stucco or a plaster prior to application of hard coat finish systems or thin stone veneer, and our joint is ready to be caulked, just like we saw in the uh, prior part of the video where we uh, applied the sealant. Now it's a functioning joint, holding out moisture, and aesthetically pleasing.